And she's back in the G-Wagon. <laughs> this is your refrigerator. <laughs> we have no gas? We have no gas. We're literally laying down back here. Oh, oh my god, there's a blue one. Hey guys, what's up? It's Nicola. Welcome back to my channel. So, I'm back here. I'm doing something really exciting today and I can't wait to take you guys along. I am finally going to be looking for a new G-Wagon! If you guys want to know what happened with my old G-Wagon, I will put a link to my q and I did right here and in the description down below. I'm going into Mercedes today. I want to start taking a look at what they've got because um, my old G-Wagon was the 2018 body. It was right before the new body came out and ever since then I've been wanting the new body. I think it's about time to do it. So we're going to go take a look at what they have, see what kind of spec I want and test drive to see what's going on with the new G-Wagon. You ready? Yes. Do you want to look for G-Wagons? Yes, G-Wagons. Let's go get a car! He wants to look at sports cars now. <laughs> Let's go a, look at the G-Wagons outside. A you want a Maybach instead? This is just classy. I feel like the G-Wagon's so much more fun. This is just so much more classy. Like, here, let me open your door for you. Look at this. Look at this. Oh my god, it's so comfortable. Yeah. Yeah, it's so comfortable. Isn't it such a lovely spot to sit? Hold on, I'm gonna go around. And the sticker on it is... 217 smack of readings. This is the same price? It's about, it depends on which one we get. So under here, you could open this up and you get a tray. Ooh! It's like a plane, but like, so much better. <laughs> This is great. This is lovely. This is a really nice spot to this sit is too. Really, really lovely. And the leather tray is really nice as well. Ooh. There's a refrigerator. Oh, lovely. Oh my god, that's so cool. We're literally laying down back here. Oh my god. This is so comfortable. It's really, really comfortable. Oh my god, I could fully have a nap in here. I feel like I'm on a kind of like a business class flight in a way. Right? It feels like a first class seat. This is great, Nico. It's pretty great. Should we get two? Like, at the same time. Oh, <gasps> oh my god, the my door opens. God. <gasps> oh. oh, it's closing. Come on. The G-Wagon doesn't do that. You love this? I think this is great, but the thing is, like, we're both gonna be driving. We're not gonna be sitting in the back. I would not buy one of these. <laughs> <laughs> I just love the. This is like a gimmick, this car. Yeah, this is amazing. This is great if you have a driver. Mm -hmm. This is great if you have a driver. They did a really good job with this car. Yeah, and they you know did what the best a, part is? They did do a good job with this car. I, can't, I still can't believe the door opens. It's amazing. We're gonna go look at G-Wagons now. I'm really excited to go see them. I'm like, just take me there already. Okay, so tell us. Tell us what they all wanna know. So What's the spec? What are you doing? Oh my God, there's so many colors to pick up. Should you start with the interior? Is it easier or do you wanna start with the exterior? No, the exterior. Start with the exterior? Like what would your dream G-Wagon spec look like? It would either be this, Silver exterior. The matte silver? Yeah, the matte silver. Fire. Or it would be a matte black. That's not black. Or this is like a dark gray, right? Mm-hmm. Oh my god. <gasps> That's a beautiful color. Mm -hmm. Look at these two compared. This one's a little darker than this one. I like the lighter one. I like the lighter one. Yeah. I also love the glossy black and the matte black. The glossy back is fire. Yeah, the glossy black is really pretty. I like white too, but at the same time, like I loved my white G Wagon, but with the new one, I think I was like a darker color. More. This green is cool, but not for me. After I had a blue wrap on my last G Wagon, I'm not so for color wraps just because you like get bored of it. Um, now, what they want to know pick your interior. So, these are my favorite interior colors. 
I either want to do all white with a black roof or I want to do a mix of black and red on the seats. Like mainly black with red accents or all red in a black roof. I think these are the best options. So, if I did a gray, Oh my god, that's so hot. Silver with white would look so cool. Mm -hmm. It would even look cool with red. Yeah, but, but I think this will like... That is I insane. think I'd enjoy this for longer because I might get sick of the red. Could you imagine this in that? That would be so beautiful. That would be lovely. That would be insane. What color would your wheels be? It depends on the car. Mm -hmm. I usually like black details, mm -hmm. but sometimes I like silver details too. Mm -hmm. If I did a black exterior, I would do red and black exterior. Mm -hmm. I also think white exterior and red interior is so beautiful. That's what I have. But maybe I should switch it up. What about white with white, white like I had on my old car? That would be really pretty. Too. With the black roof and the black carpets and that stuff. That would be really pretty. So many, I don't know what to do. Decisions, decisions. Too many decisions. <laughs> where all the G-Wagons are now. Garage, gar what? What did you say? We're going to the garage where all the G-Wagons are now. You said garage world. Garage world? Garage <laughs> where? Oh, there's one. Okay, we have a white one right here. Do you like this bag? It's white with black. It looks interior. boring. I think we should go to the garage. They have cooler colors there. Do they? So right here, we have a G63 on the left and then a G550. I am definitely looking for a G63. I love the engine on that, and I just think the body is so beautiful. What do you think of this color? And she's back in the G Wagon. Come on, let me and okay, here we there's are. a good vlogging angle on this car. It's great, that spot's really, really yeah, good too. Yeah, that spot's good. It doesn't quite have the Maybach reclining seats though. I love being in the height of this car. Like I even miss driving the G-Wagon. It's just like, literally there's no blind spots. You can see everything. It's so clear, you're so high up. It feels so safe. I agree, I agree, I agree, I agree. I don't like these specs though. I think we're both just not such big fans of plain black interior. Like we like white or red. <laughs> I think she was saying too like, these are the only ones that they have here at the moment, which is crazy. Yeah, it's a shame. Last time I was here, like, they had so many in stock. and now They got that white one, that's the only one, yeah. but the thing sold. They keep flying off the shelves. What do you think of this screen? <laughs> Don't you think they should have made it one big screen? Let me turn it on. Is the key in here? Oh. Okay. There you go. AMG. AMZ, baby. AMG. AMG. Do you miss the old setup? What's with, yeah I do, what's with this here? Hazard. How cool is the hazards on the top of the car? Yeah, I love how you could see them. Oh my god. This is making me miss driving the G-Wagon so much. Mm. This car is just such an easy and safe car to drive. And the thing is with the old body, I would get tired of driving it all the time because mm -hmm. it was so rough. But these ones, I've heard they're so smooth. They are, they really drive incredible. Yeah, she drove a lot of cars. We've test driven, we've cars. test driven fair shares. 34 cars. We've taken test drives to lunch with us. Yes. We do a lot of test drives. They like the test drives, that's how you buy a car. Yeah. Why don't we go to another dealership and have a look at what they have there? We could. Beverly Hills stays open later. Let's go to Beverly Hills. Yeah, let's go to Beverly Hills and see if they have other G-Wagon specs. And then let's go from there. Okay. All right, all right. See okay, you in the we'll next location. See you at the next location. <laughs> I'm gonna leave her in there. I'm literally just gonna leave her in there. Let me out! <laughs> you can't open the door. <laughs> I can't open the door. He can't leave without me. I have the car key in my purse. Let me out! Come get me! Oh my god, there's the worker right there! He sees me sitting in the trunk! Baby! <laughs> you had your fun? Mm -hmm. 
me stuck in the trunk? Yeah. <laughs> he trapped me in the trunk. Yeah. <laughs> trunk. Had to leave it here with you. <laughs> It is fire. I think it's so pretty, so beautiful. Mm. It's black on black. Why does the G550 have the carbon? And the G63 doesn't look? Yeah, I know, I noticed. And it's it's real carbon as well. Let's check out this interior. I took a peek before and it's quite lovely. I think it's better wow. than the 63. It has white stitching. Look here. Yeah. I think this may be an updated version to the lot to that car. This might be a little mm -hmm. bit newer. The seats are different as well. Yeah, it's a little different. Uh, this one's cool, but I think none of these are for us. I think we should go to a different dealership. Absolutely not. I think this is different. All right, let's go. Eeny, meeny, miny, mo. Catch it, you I can buy the tote. How, how did that song go? <laughs> They got another one, but it's literally just sold. Oh, oh my god! It has red and black interior. Wow. Can I spin in it or it's sold? We'll respect that. <laughs> it was so loud in there because they were washing all the just sold cars, but um, that white G-Wagon that we just saw was literally just sold. It was so pretty, the interior was red and black. Of course that one's just sold and we don't want to sit in it or anything because it's someone's car now. Ah, uh, here he goes with the Range Rovers. This is my favorite part of car dealerships. I'm gonna have a tea as well. This 4x4 is really cool. Oh my god, there's a blue one with cream interior. That one's really pretty. They just sold this one. Right now, they're driving it off. It's a G550, but it is cute. It is pretty. This wheel is different. What do you think about the wheel? Drives. Yeah, we're gonna test drive this one Because they only have G550s here and I was like I've never driven a G550 so we're gonna give it a try So here we are It's a little bit later in the night or in the yeah. day and we bought the G-Wagon. Yes, bought the G-Wagon <laughs> We ended up getting in a G550 because all of their G63 sold the only cars they had were G550s yeah. I'm not, for some reason, like, I'm not small. liking the G550 drive. It's just so smooth for me. It feels like I'm just driving a big, like, normal yeah. SUV. It kind of feels like I'm driving a Range Rover. It does, doesn't it? All the dealerships we went to, even, like, W.I. Simpson, where we just were, they just barely had any in stock. Like, they're all selling so fast. It's just no cars. Yeah, literally. They're flying off the shelves. Like, we saw the beautiful blue one earlier, but then... It was like they were literally driving it off. It was just sold. <laughs> I'm curious to know what you think of this drive. <laughs> I feel like I'm driving a G63 Loki. You do? Kind of. Am I like? It feel like the old. I'm driving the older car. Yeah, that's what it feels like. But more like comfortable. Way more comfortable. Like it feels like the mix seats of are amazing. Older G wagon and Range Rover. The like tight suspension and all that. The G63. It's not just me though, it's different, right? Yeah. yeah, very different. I think we should go back to the Santa Monica dealership tomorrow. Drive the blue And one. test drive the blue G63. Yep. I think you should definitely drive yeah. the blue one. Even if that's the only one they have in stock right now, we can like just drive it, make sure we're good with it. We can order us another one. It's so trafficy. Like specs always come in, I guess you, you just need to be like ready on dial. And they're like, hey, we just got it in, come get it. I'm gonna hide your number plate, but this is her car at the moment. I'll hide it. There she goes. 
This is Nicolette's car. Your car's in the shop for 18 months and you literally have to lease something. It's not even a rental car type of situation. <laughs> <laughs> it's like the opposite of a rental. It's a <laughs> lease. It's better than a- When the car is gonna take so long to get repaired, you literally have to buy another car. Last time I told Serena, I almost swapped that car for an S-Class recently. It was like two months after I got it. I walked into the dealership and Serena, the girl who usually helps me on Mercedes, she was like, Nicolette, no, don't even get out of here. I don't want to have to try to get you out of your lease. You just got it. She was like, no, that's too much paperwork right now. The city of Santa Monica. Santa Monica. <laughs> so now she's obsessed with this red. So, Nicolette, you, the car's bigger than you. Imagine having a 4x4. You wouldn't be able to get in any parking garages. What do you think of the red? I think this is the first year that they actually came out with the 4x4 as the new body. Oh my god, it's a good price. 562,000. They probably have markup on that as well. Wow, it's crazy. crazy. You want to get in this? All the way up here, even stepping up. Yo, that's so big. So high up here. This wheel feels like the old wheel of a 2018 wheel. A window? Up in here. It's such a big car. Oh my god, oh. the tire on the back is massive. Oh my god. It's huge. It says right here, G63, 4x4. Four four by by four. Four. This car is massive. It still wow. suits you though. I mean, it's not a bad place to sit. It feels like a normal G-Wagon. It's so big. It's dope though. It's like all these goodies and stuff. Yeah. This matte carbon's kind of cool, Look so it doesn't this. scratch as bad as like a normal one would scratch. Or little IWC. They used to do those in like most of the cars. It's the best noise it's such a good ever. sound. Well, okay, I like this. I love the 4x4, but realistically in Los Angeles, this 4x4 is not going to work out. Yes, it is ridiculous. This Look is at not, that tire on like the back. When you have like five or six cars. It's really, really cool, but like even just having the big roof we, thing. We go in too many parking garages for this, honestly. <laughs> yeah, it wouldn't fit. Look how high really? up you are. Look at it get out. <laughs> but you can't be getting out on the other side. <laughs> oh my god, my legs. This is carbon. Oh my damn. A little tiny like ants. <laughs> <laughs> my legs hurt from that. Hey, come have a look at this back part. This is amazing. This is dope. It's carbon fiber. Oh my god, this thing is huge. It is so big. <laughs> look at the, the ladder as well. So you climb up it. Go on, climb up it. Come on, climb up it. Imagine. This is my car. This is the one we're gonna test. This one's so cool. Yeah, it's dope. Okay, let's go in. You like it? Yeah, I'm really jumping it. This feels really good. So nice to drive. Oh my god! Smart. After being in like the smaller Mercedes, compare comparing it to this right now, it feels like so open. Like literally, there's this no blind great. spot. There's not one blind spot. Should we show them the car a little bit? You can see everything. I kind of feel like I'm in a fishbowl too. There's just so many windows. I love it. It's like a floor to ceiling apartment. <laughs> <laughs> Right? Oh my God, like, my laugh. There's so many windows. What do you think of the color? Do you like the color? I do like the color. I think this blue is really pretty. When I had the blue wrap on my G-Wagon, I didn't love it, but like, I think this blue is different. This wrap nice. is so nice. Though. And you could always wrap it, like matte black or white if you want. It's fun color already, which is really good. Yeah, it's already a fun color. I don't need to wrap it. Do you like the black interior? Um, I would prefer other interior than black. I don't think red interior would look good with the blue, but I do love red interior. Shall we do sports mode? Sport plus. Oh. Downshift. Downshift again. Go. Oh. You like the way it drives? I do like the way it drives. It's so smooth. Yeah, it feels like such a big car. Should we go down to PCH? 
showing? Yeah, I feel like you have to test drive every car on the seat. Babe, look at this button. You can oh. open up the exhaust. Oh, the exhaust was off. Okay, now go. Okay, now let's do it. That sounds so much better. I have missed a loud car, I'm not gonna lie. It is really nice. Yeah, so I went through my phase where like, I just wanted a quiet car that didn't really have anything sporty in it besides like, a cool sporty look. I didn't want a loud car, I just wanted a car that like got me from A to B and was quiet. And now I'm kind of test driving this. I'm kind of like, hey, I want a loud car here. It's really cool, isn't it? Yeah, what is this, a V8? Yeah, the V8s. Okay. Back to the gas we station. We need the electric G-Wagon. So we need the electric G-Wagon to come out faster because we're tired of going to the gas station. <laughs> I don't know if the car's come out yet, but there's this new car that's come out with G. Like, it's the new G Wagon, right? Yeah, it's an electric. So now one. they're we'll, electric. We'll insert a photo of it right here. Right here. <laughs> it's, it's cool. Wait, has half this video not been recording? I don't know. We just missed so much good footage. It was Nicolette. David keeps forgetting to press record. No. Uh, so basically, she was turning the corner. She was in the wrong lane. She's on Santa Monica and Ocean. And Santa Monica and Ocean, if you live in Los Angeles, you know how busy it is. It's like nuts up. And guess what? You forgot to put your indicator on. So I'm waving my hand out the window like a baboon. You're like, let me do, let me do. And everyone's like, we will not let you through. We will not let you through. It's so pretty. So pretty. BCH is so beautiful. I feel so safe up here in this car. Yeah, this is a really good hide as well to be in and when you're driving. I love this Nicolette. I do like this. I really feel safe. But do like, so you? Safe want a sports car read my mind i was just thinking about that i was like my mind is just like g-wagon or porsche 911 convertible g-wagon porsche 911 convertible g-wagon porsche panamera <laughs> okay we right swapped now. we swapped now oh my god i love this we in sports plus Features work well. Oh my lord, I love this car! Dinner! Where? Dinner? Where? That place looks so cute. Oh, that's so you have no gas? We have none? Yeah, no. Did you not We see have it? no gas? We have no gas. Oh my god, we need to get back to the dealership as yeah, soon as possible. Know. You took us on PCH, Nicolas. Yeah, and the thing about PCH is that there's nowhere to turn around for like 30 minutes. Oh my god, what are we gonna do? Can you imagine? Running at a gas during your test drive. During the test drive. <laughs> oh God. That was a lovely test drive. So I love this car. I've decided that I really do enjoy it. I think I need to go for more like gloss black, satin black, or a white. Comment down below what you guys think. 